right, guys. Can't take it. Moss is asleep. It's like one minute to her birthday. Gotta be on something. It's her birthday, the shortest day of the year. It's got some significance this year. So, I wanna see something magical happen. We got Red Hottie. Let's see if Red Hottie will be nice to old school on this day. Here we go. I don't think it's gonna make any sounds unless they fixed it. And they didn't. Doesn't matter. I'll be happy with the bonus there on the line. Right there, get up, get on up. Come on, bonus. There we are. Let's do it. Thank you. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on. Not being nice. Handle. Hmm. Put the handle again. Thank you. Thank you, handle. Come on, show me something good. 300. That's pretty good. Try again. Been here before. It's going to be 300 again. We're going to try again. Too fitty. What does it say? It's got to say try again, right? All right, try again. Here we go. Come on. Thousand. 300. It's going to tell me to take the offer. Which it does. And uh, let's try again. F it. Here we go. It's 550. Thank you, birthday magic. <laughs> you helped out a little bit. That was awesome. <laughs> I was said I should have taken that 300. That was gonna be 50 bucks. Cheers. All right. Got to do a couple of backup spins. Back to back. Maybe all this banter is going to make it happen right now. <laughs> Close. If you could join the party, that would have been talk of the town. All right. That's a $500 win, guys. Cheers. Happy birthday, Moss. Love you. All right, Wheel of Fortune after Moss. <laughs> Wanted to play Wheel of Fortune, which we didn't earlier. And I just went on Red Hottie. I owe it to a hundred bucks here and a hundred bucks in the red, white, and blue in the same room just to see what happens. It's her birthday now. I hit that uh, Red Hottie five minutes ago on her birthday. So, hopefully the magic will continue and we'll test it out right here on Wheel of Fortune. This is like the litmus test. Old school slots of birds. Come on. Let's see that spin right there. Come on now. Thank you. Here we go, guys. True test of faith. <laughs> and Moss's birthday. Well, seven minutes into her birthday now. Let's see what happens. On the beat. Let's see something big. 
Can't be a hand pay. 300? Better than 150. We'll take it. We'll take it. Thank you very much. Let's give it a few backups. Not back to back. Come on. Couple more. All right, last one. Hmm. Taking it out. Going over to red, white, and blue. Check it out over there too. Stay tuned. All right, guys. Little red, white, and blue wheel of fortune. First machine good, second machine good. Is this machine gonna be good? We'll see. It's crazy, crazy, crazy. Not usually the way I play, but we'll see what happens. Let's see if red, white, and blue, Wheel of Fortune will be nice, it's old school. And continue the magic, here we go. Sweet off the bat. Almost like getting a spin on the first spin. Come on. Oh, so close. I'm talking about not on the last spin but the second to last spin let's make it happen here we go bah, 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 bah. something nice and big please 600 nah fucking a quarter could have been a hundred but it wasn't <laughs> All right, at least three more spins. And take $100 somewhere else. We'll see, back to back. That works, that works, thank you. All right, five more spins. A little solid attitude. Come on. Oh. Come on. Last spin. It should be. Or should I play 10 more spins? It's like a dun, 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 dun. Yes, I had a few too many tequilas. So what are we gonna do? Everybody wants to see you go down in flames or come out shining. So, forging on and losing. <laughs> on that first spin. Come on. Come on, spin. Make me a believer. Otherwise, I'm going down in flames. Thank you, Blank. Come on. Thank you. Back to back. Almost. Come on. Really spin. Get on the line. Get to the line. Last spin. Close, but not this time. <laughs> all right. Cheers, all. Thank you so much for watching. 
hopefully. Triple double, red, white, and blue, $15 a spin. Will be nice to old school. Here we go. <laughs> Those triples join the party, we'd be happy. Come on, triple right there, we'd be happy. On the line, we'd be happy. All right, enough of this commentary. Make it happen, please. Come on. Maybe a little handle. How about one more handle? All right, full credit. Thank you. All right, right direction. Come on, would have been sweet. <laughs> would have been sweet. On the line, please. On the line, please, whatever, either way. Come on. credit nope not this time maybe time to go to bed cheers all 40 credits yes thousand dollars you are on the right channel this is old school slots we are going big here tonight guys fifty dollars a spin let's get this top dollar on the line right here here we go Bring you right in there with me. Come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Top dollar right there, please. Thank you. Buck and a quarter. Top dollar. Get on the line. Thank you. Almost even. Top dollar. Ooh, thank you. We'll take that. Up 275 right now, guys. Not enough, though. Come on. Let's do it. Come on, top dollar right there. Tyler now would be perfect. Mm, right there, come down. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's do this now, guys. Let's do this for Moss. Here we go. First offer. Twenty-five credits. Mm. I'm a rookie, but even I know. Try again. Come on. Here we go. Second offer. Hey. Nice. Five credits. Hey, that's a hand pay, guys. And take offer. Mama, old school slots. Happy birthday, baby. It's <laughs> only 35 minutes into your birthday, and we will take that right here Boy, and say cheers. I love you. Let's see what happens tomorrow. All right. Happy birthday, Moss. My first hand pay on top dollar and 40 minutes into your birthday. Hope it's going to be a good one because we still got tomorrow morning. Cheers, all. Thank you so much for watching. This part two. All right there. 
first hand bait under the belt. At top dollar. Not double top dollar. Would have been nice if it was double, but it's all good. We gotta do a backup spin, right? Back to back. Let's see if it can't happen. I'm waiting for this. Again. Let's do it. Nope. Eh, we can go down one more spin. All right, we'll take out our hundred, oh, excuse me, thousand plus $25 and a $13.75 hand pay, which makes it a $1,400 winner. Cheers, all. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully tomorrow it'll be even better. Cheers. Well, after that awesome birthday win for Mrs. Old School Slots, I thought it was only appropriate for a celebratory snack to be one of Moss's secret recipes, the flan. We're gonna be making this bad boy today and it's gonna be delicious. Here we go, guys. All right. So here we have the ingredients for all that you're gonna to need to make Moss's awesome flan. Four eggs, one cup of sugar, one can of sweetened condensed milk, half and half, 14 ounces, the exact amount of the condensed milk. We just pour it in there after we put the condensed milk in to measure out the half and half. One tablespoon of vanilla extract and about a quarter cup of water to make that caramel sauce. So let's get that caramel sauce started and get the show on the road. All right, guys. So we have a saucepan now over medium to medium low heat, and we're just gonna add the one cup of sugar right in the pan like that, and the quarter cup of water. Now, this is gonna get super hot, and you're gonna have to boil it until the uh, caramel sauce, it turns nice golden brown, and uh, you gotta be very careful when you work with it. But it's very simple to make. So we're just gonna let it simmer, and then I'll show you what it looks like as it's cooking, and what that final awesome caramel sauce turns into. See you in a sec. All right now, so while that caramel sauce is cooking, this is Moss's secret trick that makes her flan super silky, smooth, and awesome. We strain the eggs, a little different. So basically, you're just gonna take a uh, strainer over a bowl and pour the eggs right in there. And you're just gonna sift it through with the spatula. And you're getting rid of this little uh, white part here and making it awesome. So we're just gonna break the yolks, sift it through, and then I'll show you the finished product, which is gonna get mixed with the condensed milk and vanilla mixture. Be right back, guys. All right, so here we have the strained eggs, and we're just gonna take the condensed milk, which is super thick, and just whisk it in. Get that whole can in there. And once the condensed milk is combined with the eggs, we're just gonna take the half and half, Fill up this cup, or I should say can, and pour it right in as well. And I'll be right back to show you that. All right, now with our makeshift measuring cup, which we just poured the half and half in, the condensed milk can, we're just gonna whisk this in, which is a lot easier because the half and half is a lot thinner than the condensed milk. All right, and now all we gotta do is add in our vanilla extract. How simple is that? And now we're going to fill up our ramekins and cook the flan. So we'll be right back. All right guys, so here we have the caramel sauce cooking. It's been bubbling for about uh, 10 minutes now, and as you can see, it really doesn't require anything except a watchful eye because it can burn really quickly if you're not careful. Once it turns a nice golden brown color, 
it's ready to go. But again, it is super hot, so be very careful when you're working with hot caramel sauce. We'll show you that finished product and get it into the ramekin and cook those flans. All right, guys, you see that rich golden color? That is ready, and you know what? It's only about five minutes after you saw it when it was still cooking. So you gotta keep a watchful eye, it's ready to go, and I'm gonna have Moss help me put it into the ramekin because again, it's a little tricky and you gotta be super careful. Here we go. Okay, so Moss has got the caramel sauce and she's gonna pour a little bit in and I am going to swirl it around to coat the bottom of the pan. That's good, that's good, yep. And now let's put it in here. All right, see now, you coat the bottom and it's super hot so you have to be careful. And this is the trick that makes that caramel lovely all over the flan. And we do the same thing with the larger one and just kind of let it coat around there. It's almost like a candy shell. And as it cooks, it will melt again and get into that flan and give it an awesome, rich, sweet flavor. I think that's good. And I think we're ready to fill up these ramekins and get it going. All right, so now we have everything ready to go. So I'm just gonna take my bowl and I'm gonna fill up these ramekins with the flan mixture and be real careful. All right, looking good on the little guy. And then we're gonna put the rest in the big one here, right up to the caramel line. Perfect, okay. And now we're gonna place them in our makeshift double boiler. Not to be confused with double diamond. Ha ha ha. Okay. And now all we're gonna do is we're gonna take some super boiling hot water and fill it up on the side carefully. And we're gonna put it into a 350 degree oven. And we're gonna check on it in about 40 minutes and see how it's doing. All right, so with this getting ready, we're gonna pop it in the oven and I'll see you when it's ready. All right, so it's been about 40 minutes at 350 degrees and we just do the little test with the shake and you see that the flan is firm, it's not really jiggling. So these bad boys are ready. We're gonna take them out of the water and we have to let them cool down to room temperature before we can serve them or flip them. And that's the reason why we have uh, two sizes, guys, because Moss usually likes to have her flan in the, uh, the big container or ramekin and slice it out like a pie. But the traditional way is to flip it over and let that caramel drip all over it and have it that way. So we're gonna show you the traditional way in just a sec. All right, guys, so we have the little one out of the oven right now. And what Moss just did is she took a thin knife and just went around the edges to make sure that it is loose. And you can see that I'm spinning it now. So it is definitely ready to go. And all we're gonna do is we're gonna take a nice flat plate, put it, set it like this, and we're just gonna flip it in one quick motion up and over, and forgive me because I'm doing this on camera, which I've never done before. So let's hope this works. Here we go. Mm. Nice sound effects there. Give it a little tap. And voila. How does that look? That looks delish. Nice ramekin. Flan, out of the ramekin. Let's slice into this bad boy in just a sec. Let me get my serving plate, I'll be right back. All right, I got my trusty knife to just cut into this. And Moss is laughing at me because she would just normally dig in with a spoon, not make these little tiny slices here. But just wanted to show you what it looks like with the consistency and everything like that and the flan is ready to go with this caramel sauce. Drizzle it on the side, and this is a tasty dessert that is simple to make, and I just broke it, but it's okay. It's all going to the same place. 
So cheers, guys. I hope you enjoy this celebratory snack, also known as Moss's favorite dessert. Cheers, all. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. We're going to bring you some more slot action real soon and hopefully lots more celebration snacks to go with it.